ain't what you want. Project, project, this ain't what you want. This ain't what you want. Alright everybody, let's get back to the video making. It's something that we do over here on Anlash. That's one of the it's one of the things that we know about. So let's see about this Jordan Peterson. What the hell are we gonna do without men? You look around the city here, you see all these buildings go up, these men they're doing impossible things. They're under the streets, working on the sewers, they're up on the power lines, in the storms and the in the rain, they're keeping this impossible infrastructure functioning. Mm. This thing that works in a miraculous mm. manner. Mm -hmm. They work right to death. To, to death. death. Yes, right. So true, Jordan. And often, literally, it's in oft most of the time. It's so very sad. Very useful to tell. Oh. Everyone, not just men. Not that they right. have. Okay, I'm listening. An important role to play. Right. A necessary well, role. Well, what and is it? Well, what is it, Jordan? They act properly and honestly mm. well what if you can't do that and forthrightly that i can act forthrightly all rightly that they can put their lives together and they can help their families clean my room that's what he means when he says clean my room he means get the smoothie off my desk get this out of here oh geez i just i just got Smoothie all over my fingers. My, my hand is dirty. I don't want to lick my fingers, Jordan. But, but I should clean my room, right? That's what you're telling me. And they can make their communities better. And that that's not toxic masculinity. It's not. It's not toxic. You know what, Jordan? You know what, Jordan? It's not toxic to make the world around you better, okay? And, and, and as, a ma as a man, I, I just want to say that, you know? I just want that to be known, but also that's not what you're doing, and you're a little weird and, and kind of gross, so. That appalling phrase. <laughs> what the hell are we gonna What the hell are we gonna. Oh, yeah, another word he brought up earlier for no reason. Mm -hmm. Pagan times. Mm -hmm. and pagan yeah. time. Now we're back to pagan times. Definitely nature worshippers. It's like the. In you know this word, the environment. What the is that what yeah. is what is an environment what what is an ecosystem what what does that word mean okay we're in the bigger picture in the metaverse what does what is a plan okay that's my question you know you know that's gaia that's the new female day gaia she sounds hot mm -hmm. and they are definitely nature worshipers it's like the in, you know this word the environment what the, the environment that was the word i was looking for i mean oh, listen guys gaia sounds like a bad bitch I'm not gonna lie to you. Gaia might have just like my uh, dick. Get it? C Cause I have a, cause I'm a penis haver person. All right, anyway. What is the environment, Jordan? You know, that's Gaia. That's the new female deity that we sacrifice children to. The environment. You have to save the environment. What the hell is the environment? What does that mean? You know, I grew up in Northern Alberta. What was the environment? You go out, you go out in the bush in the spring in Northern Alberta, you'll run smack dab into the environment all right. Damn, this is... He's an Albertan. Well, look out for his Jufro. You know what I'm saying? That's what they say about the Albertan. It, it's this hair in the back that you got to be careful of. Seducing you, you know? that That's what will get you no longer with the Albertans. Eatos and black flies. Yeah. You'll be one miserable little primate no time. Ooh. Isn't it beautiful? Oh, oh, like oh. Facts, Jordan. Facts. Let's, let, let's wind that back because that's so true what you said about bugs. The environment. What the hell is the environment? What does what, that mean? What is it anyway? What, what is it? I grew up in northern Alberta. What was the environment? Okay. You go out in the bush in the spring in northern mm. Alberta and run smack dab into the environment all right. Clouds of mosquitoes and black flies. Yeah. You'll be one miserable little primate, no time flat. Isn't it beautiful? Oh, oh, so we're prim so, so so I'm a primate now. Call me a monkey because I can't deal with bugs. As if I haven't eaten a bug before in my entire life. Probably. Like it is if it's a, what would you call it? <laughs> why, 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 why do you look like that, Jordan? An impressionist painting of the French. You're not doing an impressionist painting. You're being a retard. Yeah. Yeah. I'm but, from Australia. A lot of deadly animals. Oh, yeah, They're yeah, not yeah. fun. Oh, the, of course. I knew. Uh, what did I say? I said this guy. I said this guy was an Aussie. He's an Aussie. He should. He should be murdered for that alone. What's Jordan Pearson doing in Australia? Somebody was like, oh, well, if you're ever in Australia and Jordan Peterson's like, let me be on my way to record your podcast. I want to be on a podcast. Jordan Peterson needs a podcast, you know, to be on and share his ideas. 
He he can't share his ideas with his own people. He needs new resources to share his his thoughts and plans with. You know, and that's why he's yeah, right. cold, that's like right. clinging to the edge of <laughs> the right. continent. Does everything yeah. else? Oh, he thinks. Oh, he's 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 killing, killing on stage. It's so cute. Oh, he's so happy. I've heard that in Ireland they have now forbidden people to build fireplaces in their house. Oh, this is a this is we're gonna get to it. Lots of cities. Off. There's lots of cities that are doing that. Well, they're trying to ban mm. gas, gas appliances. How could they ban gas, Jordan? For the same reason, mm. you know. Montreal and Canada, they were going to ban... Oh, think of the cities. The wood-burning mm. ovens that... A, an oven that b burns. Well, that just seems logical, Jordan. The There's a uh, Jewish community in Montreal that's very... Well, well, we can't oppress Jews. What? No, not the Jews, Jordan. Not the Jews, Jordan. Long-standing and the... They... Yeah, yeah, the Jews are... The, the Jews are long-standing. Make... Uh, Excellent bagels. They're famous, okay. like New York. Of course, the Jew. Hey, shout out to the Jews. The, their bagels are great. Famously so. You know, this in in this is proof that I'm not anti-Semitic. For when I make a video about Zionism and why Zionism is bad and also fake. It's a fake idea. Montreal bagels are famous too, and uh, shout the, out burning ovens. They did the same thing in New York with the pizza ovens. Bagels. Have a wood burning fireplace. Jews. It's like, so what these bloody, these bloody nature worshippers, they'll take everything from you. You know, you know what this? They'll take the Jews from you. These nature, na nature worshippers, these nation, these nationers. The forty consortium is? No, I've heard of it. I don't know about consortium. I know that's Latin. Do you know Latin, Jordan? I don't know enough about it. Yeah, well, there are a lot of. Fun. Oh, he's he's upset that he doesn't know enough about it about this Latin consortium. It's fire. You can look them up. Yeah, it's a consortium. Yep. Of municipalities, 40, 40 of the biggest cities in the world. 40 of them. Um, 40. So what's their agenda? What is it? Well, what is it, Jordan? You, you can't even believe this is true. No, I, I bet I won't. Like, it sounds like a conspiracy theory. Yeah. Okay, I'm listening. Read the documents like three times because I read them and then two. Right. No, I get, I get, I know how documents be. Months later, I think there's no bloody right. way yeah. that can be. Blood, I, that's what I say. There's no bloody way. That's, that's what I say, George. That's the exa exactly what I'm saying, you know? So, so what, but, 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 but what do we have to say about it? You know, Jordan. One short haul flight per person every three years. What does that mean? Right. 95% reduction in automobile ownership. You know this idea we're going to have electric cars? Yeah. Everyone knows the grid can't. Everybody knows. Withstand that. So what's the... What's you know and I know and we all know that, 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 that you know, like he says with his, with his, is that a wedding ring? I don't even think it is. It's the wrong hand. But that, that the grid can't withstand electric cars. That's what they can't withstand, you know? That, that's that's what we have to rail against now because who is who is pushing climate change you know who who is it who is it pushing who is climate change pushing and who's being pushed by climate change who's being pushed who's who's doing the pushing that's my question Get a car when it comes to climate change buddy yeah what was the grid cap who did he just call buddy withstand that so what's the what's the plan you don't need a car buddy yeah stay with you, you. well I want to see my parents, so I, I choose to have a car when I want to see my parents. And my car is being stored in a decent spot when I'm not seeing my parents. So, Jordan? Jordan. You ordinary person? You don't need a car. That's way too much. You're, you're cluttering up the planet. No me. No, no, there's there's actually space for my car. There's not space for cars other places, but I'm my car. Don't yell at me. Don't yell at me, Jordan. I'll yell back. You know what, Jordan? You're about to make a mess. And so is this guy with his face. With his stupid fucking face. L look at this dork. Consumption. I know. No meat consumption. Oh, oh, he's right. he's upset about... Oh, oh, he's upset. Europe right now. Yeah. Yeah. Everywhere we go, it feels like people are evangelizing veganism to yeah, us. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, and finally, three items of clothing a year. That's their plan. No. Absolutely. 100%. Three items of clothing. C40. <laughs> C three items of clothing. How much bloody clothing do you need? Yeah. The planet's at stake. <laughs> you know, and you need to drive? I mean, three items of clothing a year implies that we're giving people clothing in the first place and i'm good with the people getting things you know call me a marxist call me a socialist whatever but i'm okay with people receiving items you know clothings that fit them it they could bring a style trend 
that got that government that government welfare trend you know what i mean it would be a, it would be a stylish choice it would make that'd be five billion dollars probably in profit on like five million worth of sending things to poor people wouldn't wouldn't that be awful what makes you so special yeah. what well i have a youtube channel jordan what's you above the rats and the weeds exactly stay home I, I try to have a YouTube channel that prospers and, Watch and thrives. Porn and get Uber Eats yeah. from the- I don't like porn. Electric car. Yeah. Oh, and I don't use Uber Eats and I don't have an electric car. None of those things are gonna change. Well, you get Uber Eats. What are you gonna get? You're roasted, you're roasted what? Mushrooms? Soy. Soy. Yeah, so you can- Look at him laughing at a good, he's laughing at a good soy joke. A good joke about soy and being soy and soy people. Soy man. Grow breasts as a man. Mm. Oh, I wish I had them titties. Yo. I feel like I, I have no... I'm like... Uh, flexing right now. Okay? I don't have titties, okay? If I, could, if I could have some soy that would give me some breasts, that'd be great. Shout out soy. But I'm breastless as it is currently. Okay. Also, my shirt's too sweaty to put back on. Sorry. It's so off the charts, and what really irritates there's there's a couple of things that really irritate me. He wanted to stay oh, off the dome. Get Uber Eats. You stay home, watch porn, and get Uber Eats yeah. from the electric car. Yeah. And just shut up, man. Yeah, yeah. Well, you get Uber Eats. What are you gonna get? You're roasted. You're roasted. What? Mushrooms. Soy. Soy. Yeah. yeah. So you can grow breasts as a man. Bro. Yeah. This is like the C40 consortium. It's so. Off the top, it's so off the charts. And what really irritate there's there's a couple of things that really irritate me about the modern environmental movement, the Greens. I mean, the fundamental anti-human. The Green Party. Ism and the nature worshiping is bad enough. Oh. But this is really what pisses me off. What the, pisses you off, Jordan? He's just gathering his thoughts. Look at him. So what do you do? You you restrict energy usage and you raise energy prices like they have in Germany. Okay, so who suffers? Well, obviously. Who suffers? Because because this this is a this is a matter of suffering. Who uses gasoline, Jordan? Anyway, GDK, that's not the point. Does that work? The it's a pyramid scheme. The economy is a It's a pyramid, pyramid. scheme. It's a, it's a pyramid. You're trying to say everybody's getting got. No, I know. No, I know the U.S. Treasury Treasury bonds are, are out of control. I know. We, we have to audit the Fed. Right, Jordan? The people at the top have virtually everything. That's a Pareto distribution. That oh, he's not saying audit the Fed law that a few have that's a fundamental law it's not due to capitalism it's mm, waiting this isn't he wasn't saying on the fad for than that so a few rivers have most of the water a few uh, from the river to the sea palestine will be free that's what they say of the blood vessels in your body have most of the blood a few mm, talking about aortas and and areolas and uh, uh veins that's the other thing veins jug a, a jugular he's talking about jugular but from the river to the sea the rivers have most of the water a few of the blood vessels in your body have most of the call it a hate crime two times blood a few stars have most of the stellar mass a few planets have most of the planetary mass like it's a see how retarded you are for calling that two hate crimes it's a it's an iron law of distribution and it's related in some fundamental sense to the workings of entropy. It's been modeled with money, for example. So if well, money's no, no, it wasn't modeled with money. It was just it is a money fact, is what I would say. You know, if I can just talk about it real quick. I spent three hundred dollars a ticket per ticket, over six hundred dollars in total with fees for Billie Eilish. Okay, for me and my sister. Because I wanted to be the good big brother. I wanted to do the good big brother stuff, okay? I wanted to be, like, I was feeling, okay, I got a decent job. I graduated with the, with, with the hat. You know, I just wanted to be the good big brother. And I spent way too much, way too much on Billie Eilish tickets. And, you know, I'm just hoping to be the big brother on top. Few people end up with most, and that can be a social problem. Okay, mm. now, so you have a pyramid. Few people at the top are hyper wealth. Oh, he's so happy he's talking about a pyramid. It's not like they're sitting on sacks of cash, mm -hmm. you know, their money's distributed yeah. out of me. It's a, it's the Rothschild. Economy, but then right at the bottom you have a very large number of people who are barely hanging on. Mm -hmm. Right there, like one crap That's me. Like and subscribe, donate to my I don't know.
D just just go, go in the description do do the the patreon or whatever i don't know he seems to have some some type of a cobra thing here maybe maybe, maybe if i if i incorporated snakes that would help me so go go support that crisis away from catastrophe one percent employment decline is a five percent increase in psychiatric hospitalization right just, so true jordan these people at the bottom they're they're just barely on the mark. <laughs> Mute before you breathe like that. Jesus, what are you doing? I notice you have a hundred thousand sub thing and not a million sub thing in the opposite corner. And I can't help but to wonder whether it's because you breathe like that. Right, because you just, these people at the bottom, they're, they're just barely on on the margin yeah. what are you what are you doing what are you doing what are you doing crank up energy prices yeah 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 so that's the leftist solution and so my observation with regard to that is all right so you bastards when it when it comes down you'll sacrifice the poor to facilitate your delusions of planetary everybody will always sacrifice the poor that that's the rule of the poor and that's why what we need to change about the poor in fact and you are being you're very hypocritical that's interesting, Jordan. Talking about oh, oh, the, the harms of poor people. No, your your ID, your ideologues. Don't you love that? Your ideologues are what is harming poor people, Jordan. What about that, Jordan? Let's call him Jordan. Zionism. That's your plan. Mm -hmm. And then we we should refer to this this man as Jordan from now on. You think, well, that's a little harsh, Dr. Peterson. It's like, really, is it? Are they pro or anti nuclear? Mm -hmm. Well, they're anti nuclear. Well, it oh, oh, well, don't you look dumb at this anti nuclear stance, whatever nuclear is? You look dumb because w what's your face doing? Huh? Isn't that interesting? Because, yeah, it is interesting, Jordan. Listen, Jordan, I, I don't know what you know about nuclear, but this hair in the back, it's very Montreal of you, or whatever the hell you said before. And this is how you would speak about yourself, you know? Listen, bucko. Nuclear power, especially with the new Irish go right. government, is planning to cull 200,000 cows. Why? To change the weather. This is where we're at. The nature worshippers sacrifice cattle to change the weather. Right. We're right back. Wow. Mm -hmm. Pagan times. Mm -hmm. and Wow. They are definitely nature worshippers. It's like, the in, you know this word, the environment. What the hell is that? Yeah. The environment. You know, that's Gaia. That's mm. the new female deity that we sacrifice children to. The environment. You have to save the environment. What the hell is the environment? What does that mean? You know, I grew up in northern Alberta. What was the environment? You go out, you go out in the bush in the spring in northern Alberta, you'll run smack down. You don't call it the bush. You don't fucking call it the... Listen, bitch. You don't call it the bush. You just said the bush because you're in Australia and you know that they call it the bush in Australia. No, you call it the woods in because you're from North America and you know what the woods are. Okay? In, in, because the bush is a different thing because it's a bush. It's not the woods. They have bushes, not woods. Is, uh, they don't have trees in Australia. They're, they're gay. Okay? They're gay over there. And, and you're gay because you have makeup covering this this little this little dimple or like reverse dimple that you have going on here, all right? And nobody cares besides you, but now everybody cares because we're making a video and we're pointing attention to the to the makeup cakes in your face. Listen, makeup cakes. Listen, I I think the board is doing great. I don't want to lose my job. Thank you cab into the environment all right clouds of mosquitoes and black flies yeah. you'll be one mis i've been on an island with mosquitoes before mosquitoes are no good miserable little primate no time flat isn't it i just got a mosquito just then it's beautiful yeah. it's like it is he was on the wall as if it's a what would you call it <laughs> an impressionist painting of the french yes, countryside yes. yeah that is what you would call it jordan uh, yeah but, i'm from australia a lot of deadly animals oh, yeah, yeah, not yeah. <laughs> nature yeah. right mm. nobody lives in australia right except on the because everything Good else one. is so formidable i've heard that that's funny jordan they have now forbidden people to build fireplaces in their house okay. which well, there's lots of cities off. there's lots oh don't get jordan started on fireplaces lots of cities that are doing that well they're trying to ban <laughs> gas gas appliances for the same reason mm. you know montreal and canada they were going to ban the wood burning 
ovens that oh the, no there's a uh, Jewish community in Montreal. Oh, jeez. Oh, don't get don't, don't 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 get racy with it, Jordan. It's very long-standing in the right. The, no, no, the Jews are very long-standing. So, but but my point there is th that don't talk about the Jews in terms of like like this is what he's about to say. I don't know if you know, but what he's about to say is anti-Semitic. Bagels, they're famous. Yeah. Like New York bagels, Montreal bagels are famous too. That's how this is a, a case in point. And uh, they cook. Atheism, climate change, and marriage advice with Jordan Peterson. I'm doing something with Jordan Peterson. And uh, they cook them in wood-burning ovens. And they did the same thing in New York with the pizza ovens. You can't have a wood-burning fireplace. It's like this is awesome. So these bloody, doing? these bloody nature worshippers, they'll take everything from you. You know, do you know what the C40 consortium is? No, I've heard of it, but I it's awesome. What, what, what a way to involve the Jews, you know? Shout out to the Jews. You know, the Jews are important. But you know who else is important? You know, the Jews aren't going to like this. Palestinians are important, guys. Yeah, well, they're a lot of fun. You can look them up. Yeah. It's a consortium of municipalities. 40, 40. Jordan, what is a consortium? Three of the biggest cities in the world. They've yeah. all signed. What's a municipality? Find that, Jordan. Go on to this. So what's their agenda? You, you can't even believe this is true. Like it's not. I bet I won't. Three items of clothes. C40. See, three items of clothes. Yeah, see, he doesn't believe his ass. How much bloody clothing do you need? The planet's at stake. I need a pair of socks. I need a shirt. And some pants. That's three items of. Whoa, guys. Well, I need underwear. What about underwear? Jordan, what about. Okay, so I pick underwear, socks, and, and a shirt. And now I get no pants for a whole year. You say I go a year without pants in these people's eyes. And you think that the people won't revolt in the year without pants? What if, what if I didn't have pants? I'm going to yell about not having pants. I'm going to make jokes about how I don't have pants on right now. And like, sir, put your pants on. And like, no, well, I don't have any because I only chose underwear, socks, and a shirt. Okay? That's my problem. How much bloody clothing do you need? I need four items of clothing, Jordan. And, and I don't know if this is in the equation, but I need a toothbrush. You know when you need to drive? What makes you so special? Yeah. What puts I, I have parents in another village. You above the rats in the weeds, exactly. Stay home. I'm not a rat or a weed. That's what's the difference. Watch porn and get Uber Eats yeah. from the electric car. Yeah. Just shut up. That's, you know. Yeah, yeah. Well, you get Uber Eats. What oh, he thinks this is so chill. What are you going to get? You're he thinks this is a good point. Roasted. You're roasted what? Mushrooms. Soy. Soy. Yeah, so you can grow breasts as a man. Mm. Oh, yeah, this oh, is Jordan's on a roll. Like the C40 consortium, it's so off the top. It's so off Gosh, the charts. And it's so it really true. There's, there's a couple of things that really irritate me about the modern environmental movement, the Greens. I mean, the fundamental anti-humanism and the nature worshipping is bad enough. But this is really what pisses me off. The lefties what in principle, up, are for the oppressed, for the poor. Mm -hmm. Yeah, in principle. Right. So what do you do? You... You restrict energy usage and you raise energy prices like they have in Germany. Okay, so who suffers? Well, obviously the poor. Now, how does that work? The economy. It's a pyramid scheme. The people at the top have virtually everything. That's a it's a pyramid industry. scheme. It's a pyramid scheme. That law that a few have, that's a. Right, it's a, the law. It's the law of a scheme. Mental law. It's not due to capitalism. It's way deeper. It's way, it's way deeper than that. So a few rivers have most of the water. From the river to the sea. Water. A few of the blood vessels in your body have most of the blood. A few stars have most of the stellar mass. A few planets have most of the planetary mass. That's not true. Like it's a, it's a, it's an iron law of distribution, and it's related in some fundamental sense. You think that's iron? Isn't Fe? It's been modeled with money, for example. So a few people end up with most, and that can be it's co for completely different purposes. A social problem. Okay. Now, so you few people at the top are hyper wealthy. It's not like they're sitting on sacks of cash, mm -hmm. you know, their money's distributed yeah. out in the economy. But then right at the bottom, you have a very large number of people who are barely hanging on. Right? Everybody buy bonds, buy bonds, everybody. They're like one crisis away from catastrophe. 1% employment decline is a 5% increase in psychiatric hospitalization, right? Because mm -hmm. you just, these people at the bottom, they're, they're just barely on. On the margin. Yeah. Crank up energy prices? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So that's the latest yeah. solution. And so my True. observation with regard to that is, all right. What's your observation, Jordan? So you bastards, when it, when it comes down to it, you'll sacrifice the poor to facilitate your delusions of planetary messianism. 
That's your plan. Mm -hmm. And then you think, well, that's a little harsh, Dr. Peterson. It's like, really, is it? Are they pro or anti-nuclear? I call you, I, I, I think we're on a first name basis. Mm -hmm. Well, they're anti-nuclear. Well, isn't that interesting? Because nuclear power, especially with the new technology, actually happens to be quite safe. The small reactors can't even melt down. Plus, they produce zero carbon dioxide. So what's the agenda here? Exactly. Is it like mm. human beings shouldn't exist? Or is it... What is the agenda with Jordan? You tell me what the agenda is. I think that you would you would agree that on paper it's one thing. When really, in reality, it's a whole other. You know? And what do we do about that? What do we do, Jordan? Jordan. I'm lost, Jordan. We need to get rid of carbon dioxide. Well, if you want to get rid of carbon dioxide, why should shut down the nuclear power plants, mm. especially when you're making energy more expensive and that hurts the poor. And then mm. there's something even more pathological about that. Right. Because you might say, well, what happens when you make energy expensive? And the answer is, you make the environment worse, not better. Mm. So, <clears throat> why? why? Why, Jordan? Well, poor people discount the future, so they live for the moment, mm -hmm. mm. and they'll burn up the future. That's what happens in the developing world. I mean, part of the reason it's environmentally devastated in the developing world is because... Is that... Is that, ra that that feels racist? People don't have the luxury to think more than past lunchtime. They don't have the wealth. Mm -hmm. If you bring people up to five thousand, no, because okay, because people will always figure it out. Okay, that's why they don't value the future because they they find themselves in a position where they will always figure it out in the now, and that's very important. And they don't have to figure out. They realize that they don't have to figure out much else past the now if they can figure out the now and so you've made that like you're making it your problem that they are deciding to live life that way because it doesn't work for you so fix that thousand dollars a year gdp they start being concerned about the environment so so what's the solution drive energy costs down Let, let's actually go back stated in the developing world is because people don't have the luxury to think more than past lunchtime they don't have the if you let them, they could, and then they would. But you like that they don't, and you've also, that's also a double-edged sword. Well, mm -hmm. if you bring people up to $5,000 a year GDP, they start being concerned about the environment. So, so what's the solution? Drive energy costs down. Yeah. 5,000 is crazy. It's very low. Eradicate poverty. Everyone will become concerned with their children and grandchildren. They'll start taking local action with regard to the mm -hmm. environment. Everybody has enough. Children have opportunity and local activity that's devoted. He's so dumb though. I'm about to be done with the video.